Hey everybody, it's Starcaster here. Today's episode is going to be a shorter one. I got a new pet from the cooking festival. And we're going to activate her. So we're just going to have a discussion. Just a discussion. Just, I'm just going to talk about the game. And some things that I find questionable. So here we go. What's the new pet you may ask? Well... It is Siobhan. It is another mythic pet. I got her from the cooking festival. I first unlocked Crow Saber, and then I did Siobhan, and now I'm using the um, six month celebration to get uh, Lovisa. And I'm going to get Lovisa after the sixth cooking festival, as long as I place in the top 10, because the top 10 gets 30 uh, superior. The pet vouchers for Loivisa and the Mythic pets. So as long as I place in the top ten, I'm good, and I don't think I'll be I'll have a problem with that. So yeah, let's activate Siobhan. Here we go. How much BR do you think she's gonna give me? I'll let you guys take a guess. Okay, here we go. Eight. <laughs> no. No. It did it. <laughs> wow. I'm going to have to go over. I'm going to have to watch this video again like four times. I do believe that was 844,000 BR. I went from like 8. Point, like 5 million, 8. 5 million to 9.7. I'm almost at 10 million BR. That is... That's pretty... That's pretty awesome. Wow. Yeah, because let's... I want to see what her... Uh, okay, I got that uh, affinity. Removable. Let it go. Um, I know there's another one that has Siobhan in it. I thought there's three that had... Ah, oh, there's, there's one. Tyrannus and Siobhan. Um, ah, uh, Cryosaber and Siobhan. Yeah, okay. So I got... Getting Siobhan, she's a, one of the affinity bonuses for a bunch of, for Tyrannus, for Cryo Saber. See, that's why I got that much BR. That's pretty awesome. That's, it's sick, actually. Sweet, 844,000 BR from activating Siobhan. Cool. I'm, I'm excited to get Aloy Visa. I don't know what she's going to give me. Um, where is she? There she is. Um, she's at 72. So, I'm not, um... Let's see. Okay. Hmm. Her pet affinity is Cinder. And oh, let me. Cinder. How many? 24 of 75. Hmm. Okay. Well, I don't think Loivisa is going to give me that much. I'm pretty sure. We're sent 30. Um, I'm thinking here. Sorry. Hmm. What is the daily ranking reward? 40, 40, 40. Okay, so 40. Okay, I'm going to get Cinder as well. Right? Cinder. Okay, cool. So I'll use the daily reward to get Cinder, and then I'll use the overall ranking to get uh, Louis Visa. And I'll do a video of that, of me unlocking both of them. Um, or I'll do a video of me unlocking Cinder first, and then a video when the cooking festival ends of me act activating Loivisa, and pro I'm still debating on what uh, wing I want, um, either Hades or um, probably Hades. Seraph, I have like I don't think I'm gonna worry about Seraph because Seraph is part of the. Uh, world boss yeah she's part of the world boss and i'm at i think i have like i'm right there where is she anybody see seraph hello yeah so yeah so i have seven more fragments until i get her so that's i'll just kill the world boss um 
Wednesday and I'll probably get her. So next on the plate is a discussion with you guys and I want to get your guys' opinion on this because this has been bothering me. You go to the cooking festival, which is cross server, and you turn your eyes to the ranking and lo and behold, there is a person at 43,000 points. 43,000. 43,750. I, it, it's mind-blowing that a person is that high. I'm at, I'm fourth and I'm at 9,200. I'm not even at 10, I, I haven't broken 10,000 yet. It's just ludicrous. So I want to do some math here. If that person is first on their server, like, which, if they aren't now, they will be after that. Um, they will get 1,250 diamonds. So I get 1,250 diamonds every day at 10 p.m. So that means that person will get 120 points and 120 cooking tokens. So that means that just with daily rewards, they will have 240 points. Um, and if they did the daily quest, if they got all these chests, which I'm working on, and all the diamond ones, so uh, the sharing, invite friends, and the lucky draw, that is a total of 750 diamonds each day. So 1,500, so let me, okay, I'm, I'm bad at math here. So 2,500 plus, so about 3,300 diamonds-ish. That's rough 3,300-ish diamonds from their arena ranking and doing the daily quest. So 30, did I say 3,300? I think, so let's just, I know I'm probably wrong, but I'm just, I'm just going to say 3,300. Um, 3,500, let's go 3,500. So 3,500. And so which means they, they will have the, they would be able to attack. They would get, they would, they would have, uh, um, about they would get three uh 350 cooking tokens and their points would be in the 3000s i think i may be wrong hold on i'm really curious now cuz maybe my math is completely Messed up. So I bought two. Why did I buy two? The stupid cook. So if you cook once, 10 cooking tokens and 10 points. So from 3,500 diamonds, they would be able to cook 35 times, which means their points would be, would be, um, so yeah, they'd be able to cook 35 times. 30, yes, 35 times, and their points would be, I'm um, doing the math here, like right around 3,000 points-ish, if my math is correct. Um, do I have anything that can calculate some of these? But so let's just for let's just say four thousand points from any other diamonds they get from plunder order. So four thousand points, free points. So that leaves pretty much thirty nine thousand points that they would have had to have bought. 40, 30, 39 thousand points they would have had to have received from buying diamonds. And you get one ingredient for a recharge of 100 diamonds. And then you get, and then it costs 100 diamonds each to buy another ingredient. So recharging, uh, recharge. So let's just, where's the recharge? There it is. So recharging um, 1,000 diamonds would be 10. You get 10 cooking tokens just by paying 13 bucks. Recharging 10,000 diamonds, you're going to get um, 100 cooking tokens. Now, 
I'm like maybe this person has so much money that they just blow it on the game and they just they're made of money and they just you know then that's fine but I'm really suspicious that that this person has 43,000 points I, it's been bugging me all day because I just it is suspicious for someone to spend that much money on this game that's that is a that is a massive amount of money on the game it's ridiculous so yeah but that's just me uh, maybe i'm wrong i am gonna put this to uh voice uh, um i'm just suspicious that's all maybe maybe i may maybe, maybe, maybe i'm wrong and that person did get those diamonds legitimately but there are, are a lot of hacked players on legacy discord that get cheats or whatever and they get free tons of diamonds free just by doing something and they just use that on an event and they just get super high points that is just like what but yeah this this is the first cross server event we've had on our server and i i i, I really don't think that's right if the, if they did if they did get those diamonds legitimately i have no problem totally to totally fine that doesn't bother me if they wanted to spend that much money on this game to get that many points then sure the only the only those points the only thing is you're still no matter how many points you get you're still gonna get 80 wrath wings beside the prophecy you're gonna get 60 superior pet vouchers and you get a four star glyph back that's the only other way is if he would have tons of cooking tokens though and that's where i could see that so many points coming into play but even at 9600 points um 9600 9200 so sorry i thought i had 9600 9200 um i've i've been able to i've been able to unlock prior saber siobhan and i'm going to be getting my visa as well so that's just just with 9600 points with 43000 that person's br would probably go up 5 million just from this event I, but i'm just saying if they if they bought those diamonds legitimately and they paid the money recharge them properly then i have no problem they can spend as much as they want on the game and I'm, i mean it sucks because they got more money than me but it's fine i'm not against that if they got all, if they if they have the money they can spend whatever they want on the game but i am just suspicious that this person has this much money to spend on this game and has gotten that many points and it wasn't like it was it's been this event's been going on for two days okay and this person just both it was like they were at like, I I was I was first for a bit in this event, and lo and behold, these three players just, well, the top player definitely just popped out of nowhere, and was at forty three thousand points, and that person's been at forty three thousand points since yesterday, at no since Saturday, at like ten p.m. So. Maybe they just sat here and just got off so many diamonds, so much money, and they just said bill ball and got a huge amount. That's that 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 would do it. But I wouldn't recommend that because you're gonna be first in one of the daily rewards, daily ranking. Then the next one you're gonna be last. So that's why you want to spread out what you spend or how many diamonds you use over the event. But that's just me. Um, I'm giving my opinion. Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know, but I'm a little suspicious. But anyhow, that's my video for today, folks. Hope you enjoyed it. 877, 844,000 BR. That's mind blowing. That's freaking awesome. Um, thank you for watching my videos, everybody. Um, please, please like and subscribe. And I'll see y'all in the next episode. The next episode will be um, probably tomorrow or tonight. Might might be tonight but i got work tomorrow so it'll probably be after work tomorrow and i'll unlock cinder for you guys um and maybe do another discussion but yeah thank you for watching please like and subscribe and i'll see y'all in the next episode take care star out